In this tutorial, we'll introduce photographers who are used to working in Adobe Photoshop to the world's most powerful natural media software application, Corel Painter 11, available for both Mac OS X and Windows, changing what's possible in art. Corel Painter 11 is the ultimate digital art studio for anyone ready to expand their definition of creativity. Working with the most advanced digital painting and natural media tools available, you can create the art you've always envisioned. In addition to using Photoshop's industry standard photo editing, correction, and finishing tools, photographers around the world have used photographic imagery that they've been working with in Photoshop as the basis to develop broader-than-life creative works using artistic filters such as watercolor or pencil sketch, as well as using Adobe's many tools for painting directly on an image, cloning and stamping, and airbrushing. Painter 11 begins where Photoshop leaves off. While Photoshop's photo retouching and editing tools are indeed very powerful, when it comes to taking your project to the next artistic level of expression and beyond, there is no match for Painter's incredible array of tools and the flexibility to imagine and create anything that you could draw or paint using real-world natural media. Whether you're accustomed to using a mouse or a pen tablet for your work, the flexibility and depth within Painter 11 will inspire you to new heights of artistic expression. For those of you interested in using a pen tablet, Painter is fully compatible with Wacom products including the popular Intuos, Cintiq, and Bamboo lines. Let's take a quick look through Painter's incomparable list of brush categories such as airbrushes, artist oils, calligraphy, chalk, charcoals, oil pastels, pencils, pens, sponges, watercolors, and so much more, nearly 40 brush categories in all. I'm going to choose artist oils. Let's look at the amazing array of brush variants within a single brush category. With as many as 50 plus brush variants per category, right out of the box, using Painter 11 is like having a fully stocked art store right in your studio. If these libraries of brushes and variants aren't quite enough to inspire you, the real power of Painter 11 is revealed within the Brush Creator, empowering you to delve deeply into the design and manipulation of your mark-making instruments. The randomizer is for choosing a starting place for a brush and variant, and allowing Painter, just by clicking the gear, to create a series of random variations from a wide variety of parameters each brush variant possesses, giving you a new starting place to tweak or in fact create a whole new series of random variants. The Transposer tab lets you choose two brush variants as starting and ending points to essentially create a hybrid of the two along a continuum, complete with a sketch pad to test your new brush creations out as you work, without having to mark up your current project. Photoshop users will find Painter 11 very accessible by not having to reinvent the wheel when it comes to using many of the keyboard shortcuts and tool panel metaphors employed within Adobe's Creative Suite. Familiar workspace elements such as the Layers and Channels panels, complete with a comparable layer masking function, color sets, and the color picker, and one of Painter 11's truly inspiring features, a fully functioning color mixer allowing you to use your brush or a color mixing tool just as would a traditional artist to mix oil and watercolor paints to get just the right hue, complete with an option for a dirty brush mode where your brush maintains contamination of the previously touched colors. Traditionally trained artists and painting novices alike will enjoy smearing colors around Painter 11's mixer to create a custom color palette. Another powerful color feature is the ability to create a color set from an open image file with a single click. One of Painter's real strengths is that it can allow traditional artists to leverage their real-world techniques in the digital domain. As is so often the opposite when it comes to digital art software, the more you know about using creative media in the real world, the easier Painter is to learn to use. As you can see here, Painter also has the familiar flyout menus for adjusting the parameters and settings of the individual panels. And Painter also has other familiar tools such as the crop tool, the layer adjuster, which is just like the move tool in Photoshop, a magic wand, lassos, and marquees for creating selections and channels, an eyedropper, the paint bucket for filling, as well as the eraser tool, the pen tool, and of course, the brush tool. All of these tools, as we find in Photoshop, have their associated options bar, revealing all of the individual parameters of any particular tool available for a quick adjustment. Painter 11 takes advantage of extensive keyboard shortcuts, many of them being the same as they are in Photoshop, and you can use the Painter Preferences Customize Keys window to alter and edit any of the shortcuts to suit the workflow that you're most comfortable with. 
For the photographer with Photoshop experience, changing what's possible in your art is as easy as installing Corel Painter 11 on your Windows or Macintosh computer. Thanks for watching.